a better quality of life for all. One Community Weekly Progress Update number 71. One Community is a 501c3 nonprofit organization. We are creating open source and free shared blueprints and resources, tools and tutorials, and do-it-yourself instructions for highest good living. Creating solution models that create additional solution creating models in the service of all life on this planet. This includes highest good approaches to food, energy, housing, education, for profit and non profit business creation, society, and true earth stewardship. We are creating all these things to be implementable as either individual components or as complete teacher demonstration villages and hubs. Welcome to the One Community Weekly Progress Update. My name is Jay Sable and I'm the Executive Director of the One Community 51C3 Nonprofit Organization. Welcome to our Weekly Progress Update number 71, July 11th, 2014 edition. This update, as all updates, will cover all of our team's progress and accomplishments for the last week, including videos and images. And we invite you, if you'd like to see more details, more specifics, and access links to all of the open source content, please visit our written blog. If you'd like to receive an email every time one of these updates comes out, send an email to onecommunityupdates at gmail.com. Let's jump into the updates. One community's approach to highest good education is open source and free shared, designed for all age groups, adaptable to any schooling environment, inspiring and fun for all participants, a learner, teacher, collaborative, and it includes California state education standards. This week, the core team, which consists of the Satellite and Pioneer members, finished the last 40% needed of the complete Subject of Science page, which you can see scrolling here in the background. The rest of that is on the website. We also finished adding the first 50% of content to the Happiness Lesson Plan web page, which you can see here. And behind the scenes, we finished 40% of the lesson plan with core theme of Harmony. We are also now 75% of the way done with the necessary image research for the Spring Lesson Plan mind map. Those not familiar with our lesson plans, each of these lesson plans, Happiness, Harmony, and Spring, and the others that are already totally finished on the site, teach all subjects to all learning levels and ages within the context of their central theme. If you'd like to help with this education program, we are seeking people to finish these lesson plans. We've got them all outlined and we're just looking for the creative minds who would like to contribute something amazing to the educational world through our open source and free shared education program for all ages and all educational levels. One community's approach to highest good food is duplicable almost anywhere, scalable for different needs, more biodiverse and nutritious, Part of forwarding a global open source botanical garden collaborative and includes nine different free shared and duplicable growing environments. This week the core team working on highest good food finished adding the diversity details to the heirloom and organic potatoes section of the large scale gardening page. We added 17 different potatoes and featured the 10 you see here. We also finished adding the diversity details to the squash section adding 20 different squashes and featuring these 10. On the website page, you'll also find purchasing details, planting guidelines, and cultural considerations for all of these. In this area of the project, we are seeking a master electrician and a master plumber, if you would like to help out. The one community approach to highest good housing is eco-artistic home building that is affordable, sustainable, do-it-yourself duplicable, resource and space efficient, and consists of seven different sustainably constructed village models. This week, the core team working on highest good housing added remote internet rollout specifics for 0 to 20, 20 to 50, and 50 to 100 people to our open source internet setup page, sharing the results of the last five weeks of research we have done. We also added these water heating system specifics and complete description to what this means to the open source sustainable water heating page. And behind the scenes, we put in another 20 to 30 hours on the detailed action list for the upcoming Three Dome Cluster crowdfunding campaign and also researched all lodging options for the area. In this area of the project, we are seeking a master plumber and a master electrician. If you or someone you know would like to help with this component of our open source creation process. 
One community is also creating an open source duplicable city center. It is designed to be LEED Platinum certified, provide 12 guest rooms, dining for over 150 people, and laundry and recreation space for over 300 people, all while saving money, time, space, and resources. This week, the core team updated the open source large scale kitchen page with updated images and downloadable layout details and cut sheets for all the equipment. All work that is compliments of Ben Pollock and web food service design. We also began creation of the Duplicable City Center lighting page you see here, sharing the amazing work and rationale of Joel Newman of figmentcreation.com. Carl Harris also continued work on the CAD elevations, adding in the corridor to the south side and west view, corridor windows on the north view, railings to the patio, and stairs in the north view of CAD elevations. And in addition to all this, James Nance of P2S Engineering provided the first set of bathroom venting plans for this structure. For this area of the project, we are seeking a structural engineer and a general contractor. The structural engineer is somebody that we're seeking to help us design the cupola so it can be built without a crane, which is very important for our open source goals and duplication anywhere in the world. And the general contractor is needed for assistance in conjunction and collaboration with P2S Engineering, who is helping us with the mechanical, electrical, and plumbing section of this structure. The one community approach to highest good society is globally focused, individually enriching, cooperative and collaborative, includes a highest good network and application, four different economic models, and combines fulfilled living and true earth stewardship for the benefit of all people and all life on this planet. This week, the core team completely redesigned and updated our core value of fulfilled living page to share what this value means to one community and how we use this value in decision making. We also created three more job posting pages, custom images, and updated our complete Helping Create One Community page by adding these new images and links to the specific job description pages. A better quality of life for all people and all living creatures on this planet is possible. Doesn't it make sense to shoot for that? Our organization is creating for the highest good of all because we believe that it's not only possible, but that we're the ones that are capable of creating it. Not us as individuals, but humanity specifically has the ability to take the resources, the knowledge, the know-how that exists right now and apply it in such a way that we can positively and permanently impact this planet for everyone and everything living here. Better is possible. And we feel that that's really undeniable. And so our goal is to do everything that we can to open source and free share better ways of doing things. To create a better life for all people and all creatures on this planet by improving sustainability practices, by reducing the cost of living, by creating happier, healthier, more whole people. And the way that we're doing that is by addressing the very foundations of civilization, of a sustainable, self-sufficient civilization that we think are most important. And really, it's just the beginning. These foundations are food, energy, housing, recreation, education, highest good economic models, for-profit, non-profit uh, business models, fulfilled living models, as well as true earth stewardship. Taking the consciousness for the highest good of all and applying it to the entire planet so that we can create a world that works for everyone. Simultaneously addressing the foundations of hunger, of homelessness, of unsustainable energy, of low quality education, social injustice, and inequality. All of these things at one time because we see them as not only interrelated, but as interdependent. And we realize and we know that if we can create open source and free shared foundations to address these things in a model that can be duplicated either as individual components or as complete teacher demonstration communities, villages, and cities to be built around the world. If we can create that, then everyone that adopts these models, everyone that applies these ideas and helps and takes them and brings them into their own life is a step in the right direction. This is how we see, our, see ourselves creating a better life for all. And our goal is to take the bigger picture and to make it easy enough, affordable enough, and to demonstrate it as attractive enough so that the idea will become a self-replicating model. 
causing self-replicating and self-sustainable and self-sufficient teacher demonstration communities, villages, and cities to be built around the world that also teach others how to build self-sufficient teacher demonstration communities, villages, and cities as well. Solution models that, are, that create additional solution-creating models. This is the idea that we see as, as capable of positively and permanently transforming the world for everybody. And this is what we're here to create. So if this sounds fun to you, if this sounds exciting to you, if it sounds like a noble adventure, if it sounds like an exciting adventure, if it sounds like something that you'd like to be a part of, we invite you to join us. We're constantly bringing on new people onto our team. Our team grows literally every week. Our team is getting bigger. More and more people are finding out what it is that we're doing. They're getting involved. They're saying, hey, how can I help to create open source solutions too? How can we get involved? How can we get this out there so more and more people can access it? And we have lots of ways to do that. And we're constantly reaching out for people to join us so we can make it easier and make it happen faster. And of course, if you're looking for the number one way to help us the most is we are still seeking to get the property off the market. This is a property that we've worked with for the last three and a half years. The property has been chosen to share one community so that the maximum number of people can come and visit and experience one community. And if they like what they see, if they like any piece of what they see, they can take it and go and duplicate it themselves elsewhere. Taking our open source blueprints, tools, tutorials, resources, all of those details and replicating them, adapting them, modifying them to meet the specific needs of their individual preferences or another group's individual uh, group's preferences. This is the idea of making it self-replicating. This is the consciousness that we see for the highest good of all, is looking at all of this in a non-ideological way and instead saying, okay, let's not just open source it, but let's open source project launch blueprint it. Let's blueprint it in such a way that the open source blueprints and content is designed specifically to be adapted and modified. So if you'd like to see us take this to the next level, if you'd like to see us multiply this a hundredfold beyond where we are right now, the next big step is to get the property off the market. In doing that, we could share that location with people. We could uh, allow people to understand and see where it is that we're going to be able to build with video and with pictures. And we can start taking everything that we're doing right now to the whole next level because we'd be able to do site surveys and other specifics that we really, they just don't make sense until we have the property off the market. So if you're a connector, or if you're somebody who knows somebody, or if you're somebody who actually has the ability to take this project to the next level by either investing in one community or by donating to our, our uh, 501c3, then uh, we would love to speak with you. And of course, we're infinitely grateful for all the small donations that we get as well. You know, the reality of it is, is, you know, if six million people donated one dollar, we would still start building one community. You know, so the small donations that we get are very much appreciated. And since our entire organization is all nonprofit volunteers, none of us are paid, including myself, uh, you know, those donations are the donations that allow us to keep our operation running, continuing to fund the basics of one community like website uh, operations and stuff like that. So thank you for everyone that supports us. As always, uh, if you'd like to share our information, we are on all of the social media networks. We are on Pinterest, we are on Facebook, we are on LinkedIn, we are on Reddit, we are on Tumblr, we are on every social media network out there, Twitter, of course, and uh, the reason for that is so that if you'd like to share our information, if you'd like to access it through your favorite social media network, we want to make sure that that's possible. And so we post all these updates to all those different social media networks and we invite you and we are grateful to you if you're somebody who shares this information with others and helps us to spread the word so that more and more people know what it is that we're up to. The reality of it is, is people ask, well, what will it take to get one, one community funded and completely building so I can come and visit it, so I can get my hands in the dirt, so that I can be a part of the creative process? And the answer is it really just takes the right person knowing what it is that we're doing. Or you could say it really just takes enough people knowing what it is that we're doing. Because if enough people know, then the right person will know and we can get going at a whole new level. We can take this whole creative process that we've now been reporting on through video uh, for 71 weeks, and we can take it to the next level. And so, as always, from the bottom of our heart, thank you for following our progress. Uh, if you'd like to receive a weekly update every time one of these videos comes out, subscribe to our YouTube channel, or you can also uh, send an email to onecommunityupdates at gmail.com, and we'll add you to our email list. Thank you, and until next week, we will keep on keeping on.